Amsterdam. With over 800,000 inhabitants, it's the largest city in the Netherlands. This poses many challenges. One important task is making sure that all those inhabitants stay healthy. This is done by the Public Health Service of Amsterdam, or GGD. The GGD works together with inhabitants and organizations to improve the health of everyone in the Amsterdam Amsterland region. And it starts at a young age. At the health center, 4 kilo and 530 gram. Hartstikke goed. During vaccination meetings for the national vaccination program, and at school with speech therapy sessions. Kan je die nog een keertje zeggen? Seat. Oh ja, nou dat is jouw moeilijke letter. Or during a class on how to brush your teeth. Dus we gaan iets anders poetsen dan thuis. Being healthy means you also have a healthy weight. That's why the GGD focuses a lot on healthy food and exercise. The GGD views health promotion as an important task. This is done, for instance, by training secondary school teachers. The Gamilia, do you know someone who knows Gamilia? Volgens mij herken je dat. Dat je het bijna niet kan herkennen. Bij de afdeling epidemiologie en gezondheidsbevordering doen wij onder andere onderzoek naar de gezondheid van de bevolking. Om zo te kijken van wat zijn de prioriteiten voor het gezondheidsbeleid. En ook waar moeten wij vooral preventieactiviteiten op inzetten. We zien dat bepaalde groepen meer zoas hebben bijvoorbeeld. En dat is dan ook de reden waarom we meer aandacht geven aan de bevordering van de seksuele gezondheid. Information on safe sex and STDs isn't superfluous in Amsterdam either. Venereal diseases frequently occur. Maakt u een goede vuist. The GGD runs the largest and most visited sexual health clinic in the Netherlands. The GGD Amsterdam focuses on other infectious diseases as well. Such as tuberculosis. U mag met de borstkwast tegen de plaat gaan staan. And diseases you can get vaccinated against before going abroad. Dus dan vlieg je van Bangkok naar Jakarta. Jakarta. Ja. Dit is het malaria gebied van China waar we pillen voor schrijven. Closer to home, in the city itself, there are risks of infections as well. For instance, in large kitchens or healthcare facilities, or in one of the numerous tattoo and piercing shops. That's why the GGD checks those places for hygiene. Sometimes people neglect themselves to the point where their home becomes unhygienic. This is a nuisance not only to the persons themselves, but to their neighbors as well. For instance, because of vermin or nasty smells. Together with the police, the GGD tries to trace these people as early as possible and talk with them. In Amsterdam komt veel zelfverwaarlozing voor. We zien vaak hele schrijnende situaties. Uh, het lukt het u wel om het verdere huis op orde te houden, om dat op te ruimen? Nee, nee, nee. nee, nee. One of the culprits is loneliness. People isolate themselves not only from the rest of society, but from help as well. This is often caused by some underlying problem. The GGD tries to find out what this problem is and how it can be treated. I zorg ervoor dat de bewoner aangemeld wordt voor de passende behandeling en dat diegene de daadwerkelijke behandeling ook volgt. When a home is really filthy, the GGD will call in a cleaning agency to clean it. The GGD also helps people who are addicted to drugs. This involves giving them methadone or heroin on medical grounds. Hey Wil. Hey, je was er vanochtend al geweest, hè? Ja. Nou, dus uh, je kan meteen doorlopen. Oké, okay. dankjewel. Oké. Okay. 300 voor Wil. Hi hey Wil. Derde keer vandaag. 300 nog een keer voor je. Half uurtje, hè? This happens in so-called integrated services, places where the GGD and other organizations provide help and care for people in the field of work and income. Another group the GGD focuses on is that of victims of domestic violence and child abuse. Uh, u vertelt uh, dat u de oma bent van Janneke. De kleding is, is vies vaak en ze eet slecht. En... To tackle these problems, the GGD has set up Weilichthuis. 
a centre where people from the Amsterdam Amsterland region can report domestic violence and child abuse and get advice. The GGD collaborates a lot with the police by providing care to arrested people, for instance. And performing autopsies. Oké, ik ik ga mijn onderzoek doen als u even in de kamer hiernaast wilt wachten. Ga ik doen. There are injury consultations as well. Heeft u nu nog klachten? Nee, ik voel het niet. The police can send victims of violent crimes there for an injury assessment. Daar moet u zijn. The GGD also performs medical examinations for various purposes, such as parking permits for disabled people and debt restructuring. When it comes to health, the city offers plenty of challenges. Sometimes people contribute to an unhealthy environment, with vermin nuisance as a consequence. Bij dierplaagbeheersing heeft de GGD heel veel oog voor preventie. Preventie houdt in dat op het moment dat je etensresten laat slingeren en je haalt dat weg, dat de muizen en ratten daar ook niks te zoeken hebben. Daar geven we bedrijven en bewoners graag advies over en waar nodig is handelen we. Air quality is also heavily influenced by human behavior, especially through traffic emissions. That's why the GGD takes air samples and informs about health risks. For instance, when there are plans to build a school near a busy road. The GGD also advises in crisis situations, for instance when asbestos is released into the air. 15 slachtoffers, waarvan 8 bekneld. In case of a disaster or crisis, medical assistance is coordinated and directed by the GHOR, the regional agency for medical assistance. The agency is part of the GGD and operates in the safety region of Amsterdam Amsterland. The GHOR is prepared for these situations 24 hours a day. The GHOR also gives advice on the safety of large public events, such as Sensation White and the Dam tot Damlo. But the GGD has 24-7 tasks as well, such as the work at Weilichthaus, the forensic medical services, emergency psychiatric assistance and preparedness for outbreaks of infectious diseases. All in all, quite a job for an organization that tries to keep the city healthy 24 hours a day, 7 days a week. GGD Amsterdam.